Greetings and salutations YouTube, it's Hayden here. Welcome to a new video. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. So okay, so today was a super duper fun day. My mom's friends came over, which they're like my aunts, we're like family, and we went out to go thrifting because I gave them a little tour of, um, of Los Angeles. We went to um, Rodeo Drive, and we went to Melrose, we went to The Grove, and of course, didn't really film because I was just like in the moment with them. It was super fun. Um, it was two of their first times going over there to that area and it was just so much fun taking them around and we went on a little thrifting excursion. Unfortunately, I didn't film any of that, <laughs> but I'm here to show you guys what I ended up getting. But let me film, let, let me show you guys some of the footage. Greetings and salutations, YouTube is Eden here. Welcome to another vlog. I'm here with my mom. And my aunts, well, they're family friends, but they're, you know, you know how it is if you're Filipino. They're your aunts. And we are here at Rodeo Drive. And yeah, this is the <laughs> two of them, the two of their first time. Look how cute they are. They're just taking pictures of everything. Look at that, how cute. So we're just walking and taking pictures. Nothing really too exciting. That's what I just came here for. Just for the photos. And to window shop. Oh, Balenciaga's closed right now. Hey guys, it's Louis Vuitton. And I'm wearing my Louis Vuitton shoes. I totally match. Yes. Now we made it to like the famous little street right here. Via Rodeo. Everyone's taking photos. Guys, it's a Tiffany store. And I have my Tiffany ring. Yes. Love it. The other ones, love it. And here we are, still taking photos. <laughs> oh, there they are. They want me to take a picture of them. <laughs> this is where they really want to take a picture. By these stairs right here. <laughs> Alright, you guys. We just made our way to the farmer's market. There's my mom and my aunts taking photos. Super hungry. Alright, so I brought my aunts to Crossroads! Woo! Are you excited? <laughs> anyway, let me show you guys what I did end up getting. Um, okay, so the first thing I have here is I got this Unif backpack and it's a rainbow and it's like see-through inside and it's super duper cute. So I had to get it. This guy was $16.50. Super duper fun. Who doesn't want a see-through rainbow backpack? It's like a literal rainbow. Everyone was like kind of dying over it in the store. <laughs> so that was like a cool find. Love that. Um, oh, okay. I got mom these shoes. And they are just these really cute Adidas shoes. And the, this is like, it's like a, she calls this color like Old Rose. And I know that's like her favorite kind of like color. So I was very excited to find these. I was like, oh my gosh, well, I found these Adidas. And she's kind of like been getting into like kind of like walking around this like town and like around the neighborhood and stuff like that. So these are cool. They're the, they're the boosts and they're in pretty good shape. There's just like a little bit of dirt on the bottom. But other than that, they are in fantastic condition and they are super duper cute. So very excited to have found these for mom and they were $24, which is a pretty good deal. And she picked them out herself. So, well not, like I showed them to her and she was like, yes, totally. So there was no guesswork in this purchase. She just loves it automatically. So that was good. Um, up next, this um, is super duper cute as well. And this is a Tory Burch wallet on a chain. I love it so much. It has like a gold chain right there. And I love, I love when they did this embossed Tory Burch. Like it's so, like it's like heat I don't know if it's heat stamped or I don't know, embossed, but um, it's so cool. These are so rare to find like anything from this collection and it is such a cool wallet. So then you open it up and it's just like that. There's a little zipper pouch right there and then just cards, cards, cards. So one, two, three, four, five. So that's 10 card holders. And then it has a zipper part right there. And then it just has a little button snap like that, and then it's a crossbody bag. Really, really cute. And it's in the golden brown, it's in great shape. Beautiful, 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 love it so much. 
And this guy was $32.50. So that's that. Um, okay, up next, I got this Kate Spade Saturdays bag. And I love this Kate Spade Saturdays bag. This is, um, I, this is probably like the fifth or sixth one that I found. But this is the first time that I found it in this particular, um, polka dot print. So it's black with gold polka dots. Very, very cool. This is like very Chinese New Year. Like this is like, set, this would be like the as quintessential Chinese New Year bag almost. Like, because it has like the gold coins. That means like very lucky. And super duper cute. It has a top panel, it has a crossbody. And it still has a Kate Spade little dongle. I've never found one with a dongle before, I think. I think this is the first one that still has it. So that was very exciting for me. And this bag is in such great shape. There's like a little bit of dirt right there and on the back, but that is like such an easy clean. Other than that, the bag is in fantastic condition. The interior is nice and clean. Oh, it has a little makeup stain, but other than that, it's in great shape. And this bag was, oh, where's the handle? There it is. And this bag was $28. And just for like a little bit of cleaning, this is gonna be fantastic. So there's that. Oh, and while we're on Kate Spade, here is, and oh, let me show you these actually, because <laughs> these are in the Kate Spade bag. Um, check out these super cute Vince Kabuto shoes. Mom actually just picked these out herself, and she was like, ooh, look at these shoes. And then I was paying, and I was like, I'll just get them for you too, because uh, this is from a different store. Uh, but these are uh, nine and a half, and surprisingly, they fit her. She's not even a nine and a half, she's an eight and a half, but I don't know what it is. Um, but super cute. 1850, such a good deal, and they are a embossed snake print, and yeah, it's super cute, and it kind of feels like suede-ish, but it's really, really cool, and I love, like, it's like the espadrille kind of style, very Chanel-esque, and they are like a, like a navy blue color, which mom's obsessed with, and I don't think they've ever been worn, because look at the bottoms, they are super duper clean. So, very excited about these and such a great price, $18.50. And my mom thinks that she still saw those at like Nordstrom Mac or something, so what a deal. So there's that. And then here's the other Kate Spade. This one is super duper cute, but this one does have um, wear on the corners. It has like some color loss, but that's going to be an easy fix with a little leather dye and then a little conditioning. And this bag is going to be amazing. And this has a double zip top. And I actually got the zipper stuck with the tag, so we'll fix that later. But, um, yeah, it's double zip tote, kind of like a Prada. And it's just like a nice shoulder bag in this beautiful pebbled leather. And all right, Kate Spade right there on the front. And I love the little tassel on the zipper pulls. Those are always a fun little thing to have on the bag. That's beautiful, and this one was $22.50. Stunning, gorgeous, love it. Okay, so there's that. Couple more to show you. Ooh, this one is so stinking cute. Now this is a adorable, gotta get this facing the right way. Come on. A super cute Tory Burch little dome satchel. Isn't this adorable? This little thing keeps turning around, but there's like the little Tory Burch thing right there. Tory logo right there. And I think this is black. Is it black or navy? I think it's black. It has a black racing stripe down the middle on both sides, and then it has a uh, light pink. And it's kind of like a uh, Safiano-esque type of leather with gold hardware. Again, this bag is in really great shape. There's a little mark right there in the middle, but that's gonna come out. I just, I already know it's gonna come out really easily. The inside is in pretty great shape, just a little dusty, but one zipper pocket and then two open pockets. And the zipper works perfectly. And who doesn't love a good little satchel? This bag is so stinking cute. Top handle. Crossbody strap, perfect, good to go. And this one was $47.50 for this guy. Beautiful. Then up next, I have another 
Tory Burch. This is actually the second time I found this bag, which is pretty darn cool. Here it is, black pebbled leather, gold hardware. This one does have a little bit of wear on the hardware, but I feel like it's cool. Like it looks like it's supposed to be like that, like a little bit more aged. It has like a little scratch here on the front. I wanna see if we can repair it uh, with like a little leather dye or something. I think it might like get covered up pretty easily, but um, other than that, the bag is in great shape. The interior has a middle divider, the zipper pocket, back zipper pocket, and it just closes with a magnet like that. And it is a nice adjustable crossbody bag. And this guy was only $22.50, which I think is because of it has like some wear on it. But I think we can fix up a, like that scratch. The hardware, I think, looks totally cool just the way it is. And yeah, I think it's cute. Just like that. I actually think it might, maybe it's supposed to be like that. I'm not too sure. Because even a little T kind of has it, but who knows. How does the rest of the hardware look? The rest of the hardware also looks aged, so I don't know, maybe it's supposed to be like that. I'm not 100% certain, but super cute regardless. And then this one is probably my favorite, the Peace Day Resistance, because I love this style bag so much, especially these special edition ones. And this one is a Marc Jacobs Stam, and it's in like a natural fiber, and it's like, um, quilted and then it has snakeskin trim so other around the zipper and the handles is snakeskin and then it has uh, cream leather details as well and then you just turn that lock and then here's the inside it's pretty pristine in there actually very clean and this is Marc Jacobs collection so this bag um, was made in Italy and I believe it retails for over $1,200 so, Mark Jacob Stam, beautiful. This is a, such a beautiful summer bag. It would be perfect. And I love that the zipper pull, it still has the original sticker on it too. So, it's not scratched. And this um, top strap is, it's not a crossbody, but you can easily carry it on your shoulder. And then you can actually remove it if you like as well and just carry it top handle, which is also a beautiful way to carry it. But that pretty much rounds out today's video again all these items are going to be up for the sh up for sale in the shop it's hadrian.com if anyone's interested in purchasing anything um again also if you're watching this before father's day 2019 i'm offering a 20 percent off sale to the thrift squad so that's for you guys so just dm me on instagram or send me a message on depop let me know that you guys saw this offer in the video and i'll lower the price for the item by 20 percent uh, and i love you guys so much hope you guys had fun checking out my finds and i'll see you guys all in the next video adios Look at these shoes. What's a Sam Edelman? <laughs>